Hello guys, what is up? Welcome to the very first episode of Redstone for Dummies. So today I'm telling you the basics of Redstone and what exactly Redstone is. So let me go ahead and grab a block to go ahead and start this up. Now, so first off, this is Redstone. Uh, right here is the power of Minecraft. It's the electricity of the game. It is what makes everything go round. Now, what can redstone do for you? Well, I have many. I have, I have a lot. I have a lot of redstone uh, videos uh, that you can watch if you want to learn how to make stuff. But this series is just telling you what it does. Now, right here we have a redstone torch. The torch is lit. Oh well, there that goes. Now here's something really complicated for you guys. If I put a torch, let's jump up here. If I put a torch up here, it deactivates because this torch is powering this block, which the powers that. So, in return, if you wanted to uh, power this using, see now as you can see, this right here powers this, which powers that. Now, if I were to, uh, let's say, depower this torch, as you can see, it doesn't, this doesn't get affected by this torch up here. So even if this torch is powered, the, uh, the power doesn't go downwards, the power only goes upwards, as you can see right here. Now, uh, into more basics, a button is pretty much a timed uh, pulse, which lasts for a certain amount of time. And the wooden button lasts for a little bit longer. Also, we have a repeater, which I am not in new snapshot right now, so I'm not going to be able to show you the uh, compressor or whatever, but a repeater extends the lifeline so if I were to throw out mm, that many and I were to see if this torch would get deactivated let's push the button it still gets deactivated so I gotta go a little bit further a little bit further about one or two blocks I'll go about two blocks and that should uh, that should do it so let me jump down here push the button Okay, um, you guys are winning so far because this this pulse goes out a whole lot further than I remember. Let me place that down. Let me put that on top. Let me go backwards, and we'll see what happens. Push the button. It stays lit. So what the repeater does is, if that happens, you just throw a repeater down, and it will power it. But the only problem with repeater is a repeater adds seconds to the pulse so if I were to take this to go to uh, deactivate this and I were to take this to go to deactivate this let me not throw down buttons let me throw down redstone let me throw a button right on top let me put a button right here now watch as you can see, this pulse is instant, this pulse is not. What a repeater does also is you can time the repeater to go even longer, and that's how you make a clock, which I'll explain to you in another video. So, push it. Takes a while, which is pretty cool. It helps you out with a lot of many things. Um, also, another thing is uh, pressure plates. This is really all the basics. Um, pressure plate, uh, pulse here, and a pulse there. So. If you drop something on this, nothing happens. If you drop something on this, something happens. New update, you have all different types of pressure plates. Heavy pressure plates, light pressure plates. It's pretty cool. Um, so this only works if you jump on it or walk on it. This only works if you do both. And also, um, let me give you an example. Uh, bow, throw it down. A bow will activate this, but not this. Just the same when it comes to buttons. If you had a bow hitting a stone button, nothing would happen, it'll bounce off. If you had it hitting a wooden button, <laughs> there you go, after glitches, it'll stay on, which is what it's supposed to do. So, pretty much, um, stone, only you, wood, everything else. Now, a stone can be activated by animals, but you know that's another story so anyways guys that is the basics of redstone um there's many new many more many more things you can do with redstone and other teachings i will tell you how to do that 
this right here is just the basics for anybody who wants to know, anybody who's getting new to redstone, anybody who wants to start redstoning. This is the basics. Um, I have seen some pretty popular YouTubers that do Minecraft that don't even know this. I can't believe how, but they don't. So this is just the basics. And as you can see, the um, arrows are starting to despawn. That's why you heard the little clicking noise. But yes, so anyways guys, if you like this video, go ahead and like or favorite it. If you really like it, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and share this on Twitter and Facebook. Get this series up and going. And thanks for watching.